I'm very happy. I'm very grateful for lots of things in my life. We just had a break for our, our holiday break. Did you have a wonderful break? A nice, <laughs> relaxing break? I did, too. I had a nice, relaxing break. We had two weeks off, and, uh, and Portia and I stayed home the entire time. We didn't go anywhere. We have a house that's right on the ocean. It's very relaxing, so we sat there and just enjoyed the ocean for like three or four minutes, and then we, <laughs> we were bored. And um, <laughs> Portia wanted to try paddle boarding, because all these paddle boarders are out there, and so I bought some paddle boards for Christmas. And then Portia kept saying, yeah, but what if there's sharks out there? Because, you know, she's scared of sharks. And I said, there's not sharks out there. It's winter. They're not here in the winter. And I had no idea if that was true or not. But <laughs> I paid good money for those paddle boards, and she was going to use them. So the next day, Portia is uh, getting ready to go out. She was all excited, and she's carrying the big, heavy board in one hand and the paddle in the other. And I was on the porch, and she's way out there, and she's waving. Or maybe she was saying, why aren't you helping? I don't know. <laughs> Anyway, she's, uh, she's about headed to the water, and I, we noticed that there was this boat circling, this small boat with like seven people, and they kept pointing, and they were leaning over the bow of the boat, and they were just going in circles. And I mean like literally 20 feet out from the water, like 20 feet out at, at most. And they kept circling, and finally someone on the beach went like that, and they called out, eight foot great white! <laughs> and we're like, well, that's the second worst thing you want to hear in the, right after our wedding is, has a cash bar. But I, I think that, <laughs> I mean, they were, they were seeing a great white shark eight feet right there. Um, and then we're walking down the, so Portia didn't go in. And um, so <laughs> we're walking down the, the sand a little ways, and there's a, another paddleboarder who just come in. And we told him about it. He goes, oh, yeah, earlier today, the 11 foot came at me. And I'm like, what, the 11 foot? What is that? <laughs> Like, everyone knows the 11-foot? <laughs> so there's an 8-foot and an 11-foot shark out there, and I'm thinking, I should have kept the tags on those paddle boards. That's... <laughs> Why wouldn't I do that? So anyway, we, we talked to this guy who goes out there all the time, and he said they won't attack until they're adults, and they're not adults until they're 12 feet long. But who's got a tape measure when you're out there? <laughs> You're not going to just start trying to measure to see if it's 11 or 12. And I don't even understand how the sharks even know that. Like, I want to eat that person, but I'm only 11 foot. I got to wait <laughs> another foot, and I'll get you. And, uh, but I was right. Sharks are not usually in the water at this time of year. They're supposed to go to Mexico, but because of the climate change, the water is warmer, so they have stayed there. They're probably worried if they go to Mexico, Trump's not going to let them back in. So they're <laughs> staying here. Sharks are smart, they know. <laughs> so there's two reasons I'm telling you this story. First, if you're swimming in the ocean in Los Angeles or in the area, be careful. Second, if you're interested in two barely used paddle boards, <laughs> I have beautiful ones for sale, and I'll give you a good deal. I do not want to swim with sharks, but they're beautiful creatures, and I think we should respect them. We shouldn't harm them.